And uh, I reached out to him to do a feature on the song, man. And, and you know, like I say, a uh, long story short, it kind of turned into a record deal, man, because he, he, he was feeling the key, you know what I'm saying? So mm. that's how that happened. Wow. That is something, and 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 Spice, when you saw him, you you were like, wow, you know, this this guy got something going on. You, you feel that, right? Because when I, to, in my opinion, when I first heard him, uh, I was like, uh, I actually told him off the air, uh, Q Boss Lee. I was like, man, you could have definitely hang back in the day. Uh, that's how I felt. <laughs> Listen, seriously, like when I hear him, I was like, yeah, he would definitely hung in the eighties and nineties by far. He would have definitely by far. Not even I wouldn't even blink an eye. Think if like if you if I didn't know no better and you told me like if I just land on this planet, oh yeah, boss Q Boss Lee was part of the you know the hip hop back then. I would be like, oh yeah, I believe it because that's the way he sound. I mean, do you feel that same way when you first heard his his music? When I, when I first heard Q, I was tripping. He sounded like Tim C. <laughs> see, you know that's my that's my homie. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. so, you know the, the the night I got shot, I woke the the the, the, the day out, I woke up. Uh, I seen Tim C um, on the news, and he, and he was saying he was you know he was dead or whatever. Mm. That, that kind of Ugh. fucked me up. You know what sure, I'm saying? sure. So, when I heard Hugh Bossolini, um, and he started, and he was sounding like Tim C. It was just like it just made me laugh. You know what I, mean? <laughs> I was like, this is cool as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn, because me and me and uh, Pimp C came into the game together. You know, we both signed a job. We hit, did a uh, Minister Society soundtrack. You know, he uh, he had Pocket Full of Stones. I had Trigger Got No Heart. You know, we we, we was rocking together. You know, from day one, me Pimp C, Bum, did, you know, we was always homies. You know, he come out to the to, to uh, open to the bay and hang out with me, or whatever. So we was cool, you know. But, you know, again, Q, you know, it was just like, damn, I had to, I had to sign Q. I didn't have no choice. Like, damn, I'm going <laughs> to You know, he said he sounded like the homie, and he, he reminded me of my, my guy, and he's talented. You know, he's not even trying to sound like Tim. Exactly. He sound, he just, you know what I'm saying? And, and sure. That's the cool part about the shit. You know, my fans dig it, so, you know, whatever my fans like, that's what I'm going to give them. You know what I'm saying? Shit. And I totally agree because I'm a fan of yours, and I I 100% approval on Q Boss Lean. That's definitely definitely. And by the way, you know, uh, my boss Spontaneous definitely likes Q Boss Lean's flow as well. I mean, yeah, she was definitely uh, feeling that. So it's just you know, and and a lot of people also are also feeling uh, from what I, I go to his YouTube pages and everything. I'm like, man, you got a lot of hits, and it's just uh, awesome. You know, just just listening to that man, it's like there's hope. In hip hop, there's hope. 